This is stock number 21J128. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin. Your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. Today we are checking out this brand new 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon. This Wrangler has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor which pumps out 285 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. It's going to get you 24 miles per gallon on the Highway 19 City and an average of 21 miles per gallon. Nacho Clear Coat is the color. This is a brand new color for 2021. Paint code is PY5 and we shoot all of our videos in 1080p. 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to check out the looks, styling, and color of the vehicle before seeing it in person, as well as the options as we'll go through everything on this particular Wrangler. And if you want to check out all the photos on this vehicle, in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to our website. Click that and check us out there. As you can see, this is a Rubicon. It has the color match hardtop, the color match fenders. You get the painted and polished aluminum lipped alloy rims. Has BF Goodrich all-terrain TA tires. These are LT28570 R17s and they definitely have an all-terrain tread pattern to them. You get the rock rails with the Rubicon package. The granite crystal Jeep and trail rated badge on there. The Rubicon lettering on the hood. And uh, like I said, Nacho Clear Coat is the brand new yellow slash orange color for 2021. Really a good looking color and boy, if you could nail Nacho on the head as a color, this is the color it would be. Anyways, this one comes with the LED fog lamps, the LED headlamps, and the LED running lights, as well as the LED running lights on the fenders there. A couple little Easter eggs on here. You do get the sandals and the plastic shroud there, and you do get the Jeep climbing up the side of the windshield. Also, the T50 on the door hinges there, so you know which Torx wrench to use to get those doors off. And once again, you get the rock rails there. This one has the enter and go system. We'll take a look at the original window sticker here. Feel free to pause this. I'm not going to go through everything, but uh, we'll go through the main options here. 2021 Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon 3.6 liter Pentastar with the e-torque assist, 8-speed automatic transmission. Everything on the left there is standard features. And then you get your optional equipment. The nacho clear coat is $245. Leather trim bucket seats are $1695. This one does have the cold weather group, which gives you the heated seats. Remote start system has the LED lighting group, which is $1365, which also gives you the LED tail lamps. 8.4 radio with premium audio group is $1995. You get the Alpine premium audio, the navigation system, with the Uconnect 4C radio, GPS, Nav, a Sirius Guardian for a year. You get Sirius Travel Link and Travic Plus for five years, emergency assistance call, and 4G LTE Wi Fi hotspot. Has the safety group, which is $895, which gives you the Park Sense rear park assist system and blind spot monitoring. Advanced safety group, which is $795, gives you automatic high beam headlamp control full speed collision warning, adaptive cruise control, and advanced brake assist. The eight speed and the 3.6 liter are all 1500 bucks for a total of three grand for that combo. And then the remote proximity keyless entry, which gives you the enter and go is 645. The color match hard top is $2,495. And then the color match fenders are 695. So that's actually $3,100 or almost $3,200 for those two options. Those special rims are $9.95 for a total MSRP of $59,685. And if you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives, in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website. Click that and check us out there. This one comes with the three year 36 bumper to bumper, 
warranty as well as the five year 60,000 powertrain warranty. Miles per gallon, 24 highway, 19 city, and 21 average. Here are your safety ratings, four star front crash and three star rollover. It's not rated for the other ones. So we're gonna continue our outside walk around here. And uh, just wanna point out, it does have four wheel disc brakes. What they started doing on the Rubicons and the Wranglers with the painted fenders here is they have the 3M rock guard on there, which is really nice. It's just a small piece of uh, vinyl tape, clear tape that goes on the fenders so you don't get rock chips on there. That hard top is painted all the way up. Notice you do get the LED tail lamps, the backup parking sensors, matching spare tire and rim with the HD backup camera. You get LED license plate lights, red tow hooks. Plenty of room in the back storage area. You do get that Alpine subwoofer there. Notice they color match all the bars in here. So when you do have that hard top off, everything looks like it's supposed to. You get storage underneath here, door hinge holder or door hinge bolt holders, as well as roof and windshield bolt holders. And then your jack tools are underneath there. You do get the um, bolts here. You have three on each side, one on the top, so a total of four on each side for a total of eight. To get this hard top off, you do have to take the front hard top pieces off first. And then the design on there, it's kind of a crushed eggshell look to it. You have your quick releases right here, and then they can store for that. That's for your electrical and windshield washer fluid. Then you get the JL badge right there, which gives you your wheelbase and overall length for the two-door, four-door, and water fording, as well as where it's built in Toledo, Ohio. They made those doors a lot lighter, close a lot easier. You get the metal fuel cover door there. This one has the blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors, the enter and go system, so you just have to put your hand in there if you have the key in your pocket. Inside you get the leather trim bucket seats with the red stitching. Get the Rubicon stitched into the backrest. And uh, these now have side airbags standard on them that used to be an option factory floor mats auto headlamps you get tilt and telescopic steering wheel so that'll tilt like so and the steering wheel will also pull out and push in power locks power mirrors you get that red stitching on the door there and as we hop inside we'll turn the ignition on so you can see the Jeep animation there. You do get your digital speedometer, um, the seven inch LCD display. You also get a compass display up there and you can do miles per gallon, miles to empty, and change all those corners to read whatever you'd like. This one does come with the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls and adaptive cruise controls on the right. Bluetooth and information center controls on the left and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. This one has the 8.44C radio, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on this radio. Of course, it comes with the factory navigation system. You also have the AM, FM, and Sirius. You have your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls right there. And you can also check out that backup camera, which I told you was HD crystal clear. Those grid lines turn as you turn the steering wheel so that uh, you kind of know where you're going in the future. And then if you were to put a hitch on this vehicle, it would line right up with that center line. So pretty cool there. You also have your climate controls. Notice you do get the dual climate controls on there. Now, if you don't like doing the dual climate controls down up there on the radio, you can do them on the more tactile buttons down here as well as your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls. And 
your volume and tune controls there as well. It does have start stop capabilities, which you can turn that off. Stability control, parking sensors, you can turn those off. Downhill assist control, you can turn the whole screen off if you don't want it on. Uh, the other thing with this radio is that you have all your different apps here, and uh, you also have the off road pages, which are pretty cool. They take a second to load, but there's always some fun animation that goes along here. Maybe lost, but never stuck in a Wrangler. Um, so anyways, it takes you to these pages right here. You have your steering angle, and you can see as I turn that steering wheel, your angle changes. So that's pretty cool. If you're off-road, you can see exactly where you're at. Uh, this is for your sway bar, uh, front axle if it's locked or unlocked, and rear axle if it's locked or unlocked. Your transfer case if you're in too high, four high or four low. Then you have your accessory gauges here. And then you have your pitch and roll, which uh, tells you, you know, how fast you're descending or your angle of descent, I should say, and uh, your angle of roll there. You also have latitude, longitude, and your altitude. Because we're in our picture studio, we don't get the best reception in here from the satellite, so it says we're at zero feet of altitude, but that's not right. Anyways, it's a pretty cool system, and um, that comes with the radio. There's no subscription to that either. And then you have your projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen. So if you've got Waze or Google Maps, a navigation system you like better than the factory one, you can project it to the screen. Works for media and songs and stuff like that too. We actually did a demo on Android Auto if you want to check that out. It's in the upper right hand part of the screen on an 8.4. So it'll be pertinent to this radio. Continuing on down here, we have your window controls, you have your media center here, an AUX USB and USB-C hub, and then you have your front and rear axle locks, or just your rear axle lock, sway bar disconnect, and then your off-road mode um, button right there. 4x4 shifter on the floor, you have your 8-speed automatic transmission with the Wrangler design on the top there, you have your switchblade style key, keyless entry, remote start, panic button, it's a real chunky, heavy-duty key fob. You always know which key fob you have in your pocket, which is pretty sweet. And then on the Rubicons, they do this kind of flat red finish to the dash. It's kind of cool. Matches all the stitching. And then the hard top pieces come off with a couple quick disconnects there. You get your assist and SOS buttons up there. Note, once again, you get the seven slots right above the mirror, the auto dimming mirror, and then your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Get that crushed eggshell finish look in here as well. We'll take a quick look at the back seats and then I'm gonna do a final walk around with all the LED lights on. The back seats, I like the new Wranglers because there's a lot more room back here for uh, passenger, passengers sitting back here, which is nice. Um, you get the latch child safety system for any child car seats, which that extra room helps out with as well, getting car seats back here. And then you can put these seats down. They go down almost completely flat, and you can see normally on the old Wranglers, I just did one where the seat like came down and was hitting the backrest of the front seat. No more. Plenty of room now. They go almost completely flat, and now they have this... Um, little flap here so that nothing's going to fall behind your seat. The other thing I like is that these headrests stay down now. Instead of uh, whenever you put that seat up, the headrest would automatically go up. Well, now you can just release that headrest, and uh, that's pretty nice too. And there's actually cup holders in the headrest of the middle seat, so that's kind of neat as well. Back here you get two more USB-C's, two more USB-C jacks, and then a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. Your rear window controls, factory floor mats, child safety locks, and uh, everything is in that nacho clear coat color. And we'll do one more final walk around here. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you will have been able to tell just how good looking the new Nacho clear coat color is. Learn a little bit about this particular Wrangler. 
and all the options that it has on it. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. There are the, all those LED lights on there, fog lights, running lights, fender running lights, headlights, and uh, yeah, remember to like, subscribe, and share. And if you want to see more pictures of this Wrangler or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to our website right there, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left, a link to more Jeep Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. Click those, check us out. If you want to check out our ladies' video in the bottom right-hand part of the screen, it's a link to that. So click all those, check all those out. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. And we really look forward to helping you with this brand new 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon and Nacho Clear Coat. Thanks again for checking out the video.